hey y'all welcome back to another video please remember to like and if you're new here subscribe if you have been keeping up with all my videos you'd be aware about the drama with woda and he's now beefing with a number of people he used to be cool with yesterday he took to his instagram story and he made a lot of posts he shared messages between him and nuno as well as him and two rare and so it seemed him and nuno were cool and so he said these people go to the net to troll to get money off my name all day he also shared messages with him and to rare among others i text these people in real life and got blocked while i grew up with these people and hate on them this man got a lot going on in real life i don't need to tarnish a name to state the real bro i gained none from it but what happened where the love went before you became a too rare i specifically said it's hard to find genuine people in 2022 before i even met this man he snaked me more times, I can count on my fingers lol, I just charge it to the game. These the same people that was around you, snake you, then play victim on the internet. I keep it a thousand every day, I have faults, I ain't perfect, but one thing I speak is the real. When my Omi passed away, these MF was the only people I thought was real until they got to going behind my back. I don't tarnish nobody name, though I keep it pushing, like none never happened. For these n-words, I never spoke about them on no internet stuff, never needed to. To include lies on their name when they was the realest n-word to me is crazy, but to each its own. We just didn't end well in real life, gang. My last time responding to any of this lame I hate would a train. People gonna talk on me all day. Keep it real though. I am be on the net like that for a reason. I enjoy life more if it's okay to not be okay. In situations like these, I rebuke my negative actions to others on a public platform. But this is why I stay to myself and off the grid. I'm too tough for the north ish. And so y'all I do want to know what y'all think when it comes down to this. And a lot of people is against water. And they're all people that he was friends with. And so y'all I do want to hear reviews. Now I do want to move on to this next topic. With JC. No JC posted that he finally got himself a crib. No JC and Madge always have been going at it and Madge always claims that he's homeless as during his relationship with Nadia he was always at Nadia's house and so he had this to say to Madge. I'm saying Madge old blood got my own crib and I changed old blood. <laughs> And so y'all let me hear reviews. A lot has been going on with Naima. Previously I reported that she was voted out of the house and so she's no longer a part of Compact House. She also stated that they were weird to her and that they never liked her. She also had gotten into it with Tish over Day. Now her and Day had broke up for some time now. However, they decided that she would be still in the apartment and Day would move into the compact house. However, it seems things took a turn. Yesterday, I also had reported that Naima had posted with someone new. She was also on live going off. They also made a YouTube video addressing everything. Naima also made it known that the apartment was in Day's mom's name. And so yesterday, Day kicked her out. And so she was a bit emotional as she emphasized on what actually happened. She stated that Day cheated on her on multiple occasions and that she's 17 hours away from home. And so she knows no one out there. She's also currently in a hotel. Because a lot of y'all is confused. Y'all like, oh, this, this was your apartment. How he kicking you out? It wasn't in me or his name. It was in his mom and his sister name. But we was just paying rent. We were splitting the rent. And, you know... I was already looking for places because I got tired of him throwing the get out role because it's in his mom name. You know, a mom gonna always take their son's side. And I got tired of that because it's like every time something happens, that's what he would do. He knows I moved 17 hours from home. I don't really know nobody out here. So now I'm just left to figure this shit out myself. And I always figure stuff out. So I'm not really tripping like this is a storm that's just gonna pass. You get what I'm saying? Mind you, we are not together. We haven't been together in damn near a month. We came to an agreement that I was just going to stay in the apartment by myself. And he told me that he was moving into the compact house and he was just going to help pay rent. And that was it. Like this, this whole relationship stuff, we're not getting back together. It's over with. That's what we came to a conclusion about. So, you know, that was cool. But he decides that he wants to make a YouTube video about me. Basically, I guess explaining his side or whatever the case may be. And so I was in the comments and we was talking and he basically told me like, you know how this about to go. You might as well start packing your stuff now. And I'm, I'm tired, y'all. Like, I'm literally fucking tired. Like, I'm done with all this shit. I'm not dealing with this shit no more. This shit is for me mentally. This shit, like, I'm just not doing it no more. So it is what it is.
No, she also posted a TikTok in which she went into details of how she even got with him. She also posted on her Instagram story, just me and my dog back at square one. I'ma figure this out. God don't like ugly. This in his hands now. And people are really evil as F in this world. What God don't miss. Y'all be best out there. I'm finna disappear and go ghost till I feel like myself again. And so y'all let me hear views when it comes down to that down in the comment section below. The beef between Lena and Nadia is still going on. Yesterday I reported about Nadia on live calling Lena her mini me. Also stating the reason why she didn't go to Houston to fight Lena. Now Lena posted on TikTok, you couldn't beat Ish. God knows. You're the only female in the influencer world that run their mouth but not them hands. She also had in the caption a loser. She was even on live with Fendi and she popped off. Did you cop a plea or no? Let's be for real. <coughs> BFFR. Right, literally. <laughs> okay. Like, but let's 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 all when have let's it all ever use been, our brains. Right. When has it ever been a thing for Lena to cop pleas? Like Bro. when? We're gonna leave it at that. It's no fight. Stop asking for it. It's no <laughs> fight. It's no fight. They didn't pull up. They scary. Like, like y'all better stop coming this shit for y'all made me go off for real and come out of character. Cause I'm trying to keep it cute. I'm trying to keep my composure, but y'all is about to piss me off for real. It's so like, just shut the fuck up. Talking about people that are irrelevant. They're irrelevant to us in our life. So just shut the fuck about them, please. Thank you. Cause we don't. Give we really don't. Like the shit didn't happen. Obviously, y'all see why it didn't happen. Cause nobody pulled like, up. Like, let's be fair. Y'all all talking. Y'all all on here talking about. Y'all got our hopes up. Y'all, like, why y'all hopes even up about it? They just hit in the car. Let's be for real. Let's let's be so for real. Let's be so for real right now. Like, you can't say we both nothing. Cause I'm not the one that called that shit out. Let me shut the up. Let me <laughs> let me shut up before I shut, start showing receipts and shit in this. Okay. No yeah. Shame. Clock that. No shade. Duck. Oh shade. <laughs> Like, y'all so... That's a lie. <laughs> like... <laughs> How about y'all go ask her friends? <laughs> go ask her friends. Y'all sound crazy as a I swear y'all do. But this one, obviously, if she says something, she means it. And if she says she's going to do some shit, she's going to do it. If she's chilling, she's chilling. Like, <laughs> like... Like, y'all just be doing too much. Like, y'all like... Y'all are so invested in drama, bro. It's crazy. And then when, it, when when somebody responds back to what y'all saying, y'all want to, oh, why are you in the thought I seen a comment? Literally. That's all y'all talk about. Like, like literally. And so y'all, I do want to hear reviews when it comes on to this and everything else said in this video down in the comment section below. Please also leave a like, subscribe, and turn on your post notification bell so that whenever I upload, you are notified.